don't know if this is gonna work. Hi, anyone there? Hello? Well, okay. Hi guys! Hi guys! Mm -hmm. Let's put some chicken on the ground. Let's put some chicken. Hi guys, so um hi guys, so <laughs> I'm in the middle of cooking chicken stir fry and I was filming a kinda makeup purchase or pass video while I was cooking and it just wasn't working. I could do two things at once. Hey babes. Um so I'm just gonna cook stir fry chicken stir fry and talk to you guys if you wanna talk to me um and explain what I'm doing. So that's today's video. I didn't want to edit anything, I just wanted to cook something and I have to edit, so I thought I'd go live. Yeah. All right. So I just finished cooking chicken. If you're wondering at what stage I'm at, I just cooked the chicken. It's not completely cooked all the way through. I did marinate it with um, some garlic, ginger, and shallots, and then I also put a little bit of chili. Not too much, because I'm. I, I can't handle much chili, but I want to know it's there. So that's what I did. I also marinated the chicken overnight with, um, I also did, sorry, I forget that I'm not doing a tutorial. Hi. I know it's been a long time. I'm good. I'm just um, cooking some chicken stir fry. I was doing a video talk, talking about new makeup releases, but it didn't work. So I'm just going to do it live while I cook and talk to you guys. I did marinate um, the chicken with some sesame oil as well, and then some um, salt and some soy sauce as well. Yeah, I know. Yeah, and that's absolutely fine. Um, I know. I Yeah, it's late for you guys. Sorry, Nicole. But if you want to know how the chicken stir fry comes out, I'll let you know. Um, you can watch this. We also have some mushrooms. I got a diced onion. And then I've got some shallots that, or spring onions, we call them shallots, um, or spring onions. I'm just going to dice that up quickly and um, finish cook, cutting up this broccoli as well. Also, if you want to know how to pick a good broccoli, get one that's got like a tight head so it's not loose. The little branches, as I call them, are nice and like hard, firm. That's how I cook my, that's how I choose my own broccoli. But yeah, how's everyone doing? Um... Stir fry, yeah, I cook it all the time, but I haven't um, I haven't done it in a while actually. Um, but I thought I would. I wanted my idea for this video was I could cook something while I talk to you guys, just as like uh, you would talk to a friend while you cook something, um, and talk about new makeup releases. But with all the noise from the um, stove or the wok on the stove, you can't really hear me, and um, I'm getting distracted, and I don't want to talk to you guys and be cutting and then cut my finger off. So. I thought, mm, probably not a good idea, but I thought maybe I could do like a weekly or a fortnightly cooking little session where I just talk about, or talk to you guys, talk about whatever we want to talk about, new makeup releases, anything like that. So I'm just looking down because I'm cutting. Um, so I thought maybe we could do that because I, I don't want to edit all the time. I just don't have the time to edit, you know? I'm a busy person. My cat's upstairs and all that stuff. Hey Lottie, how are you? Um, so yeah, that's what I'm going to do today. We're just cooking some chicken stir fry. I've cooked the chicken. Um, I've cut up all the onions. I'm just cutting the last of the shallots up that I like to put on the, or in the stir fry at the last second. So it's still got some texture to it. I also have some lemon that I will squeeze over at the last second just to cut through the oil and stuff. Um, yeah, let me just quickly cut this broccoli up. Um, Lottie, my dear, where are you? Going to get James. 
I, we got a lot in now we have to catch up. Um, so I'm catching, cutting this up. I don't know if you guys like to use the stalks, but I always like to cut these thinly because I like um, like a bit of crunch in my um, stir fry. So I'm doing that. But some people just use the broccoli head, which I think is a waste because the, the actual, like the stalk is so crunchy and yummy, especially when you get one that's like fresh and, you know, really crispy. So I'm just gonna cut these little branches, what I call branches on these little things quite big bite sizes um, and then I'm going to pour hot wa water over it that way I will um, half cook the broccoli heads but then I will finish them off in the wok after but I'm just getting them to the half cook stage and it's been so long I keep meaning I want to come and see your new place buddy one day you need a setup swap Makeup and stuff like that, but yeah. Has anyone seen um? I've seen a reel of the new ColourPop collection. It's giving me very Avatar vibes of like Cora and Avatar. Very similar color story from what I can see on the packaging. I didn't know anything about this new collection. Like um, Nicole and all of them had to tell me what it was. So yeah, I d I think I'll pass on that collection. Say shallots, shallots. Well, shallots can be quite two different things here. So shallots, we've got like the little um, purple shallots onions, but people call this spring onions, which is what this was before I chopped it, chopped it up, uh, shallots as well. So it can be two different types of onions. But yeah, I call them spring onions. So that's everything is cooked. We have some egg noodles. These are the ones that I like to use. They are flat. Um, I use about half of a packet. I do cook a lot of stir fry because I like to freeze some. Then I like to have some for leftovers next day and stuff like that. Um, but this is my favorite. I just like to boil these in water. You can boil this on the stove um, with chicken stock to like get it soft and it adds a little bit of flavor. But I don't have any chicken stock left today. So I'm just gonna use boiled water. And I also have some peas that I boiled, um, parboiled, and I'll finish them off in a wok. Oh my God, we have four people on here, hey. Yeah, right, that was um, December. Yeah, for Tina's birthday. I think we've done we've done some FaceTimes, but we haven't actually been together in person. Ooh. Okay, what am I gonna do first? Okay, we're gonna put actually we're gonna put this in. Put some boiling water over that and let it cook now. Do that. And then while that cooks, I have to boil the kettle again. Sorry guys, it's gonna be a bit loud for a second. I just need a bit more water for the um, noodles to start softening up because they take about five or ten minutes. So, um, talk amongst yourselves. <laughs> just use my kettle. Oh my god, it's so cold here. What, what am I missing here? Spring onions here too, yeah. I may pass on the Jurassic Park, yeah. I'm excited for that video, Nicole. Um, Profusion, yeah, I saw that. They actually, um, I didn't realize that they sold Profusion or some products from Profusion at Priceline. I was there yesterday um, and I got, I just wanted to get some more some micellar water and some of those face halos, the round like makeup wipes. And they had the Disney collection, eyeshadow palette wise at Priceline, the one I went to, um, Lottie, but the palettes were broken and they were on clearance, but I didn't really, the color story, it wasn't my favorite. Actually, no, not at um, Priceline, sorry, at Target, but they were in the sealed cases, so you couldn't actually see the palettes if they were broken or not. And you couldn't really see the color story as well on the back because the stickers were covering it, but I could see one was broken because it had like powder inside the little sealed, security seal thing. I was like, no, nah, not gonna risk it if I can't open it now in store. Um, 
Incognito, yeah. I, I don't know that collection. And the Jurassic Park, I like the original movie, but I, I haven't watched any of the other ones, I don't think so. I, I just passed on it. All right, why is that not boiling? Oh God, I'm getting distracted, guys. So, I'm gonna put some of these noodles in here. One second. Yeah. Yeah. I just wanted to make sure I didn't have any open packets of these before. I always have two or three of them in my um, pantry. So, okay. Put six of these in here. Seven. Maybe, maybe eight, because I do like, yeah, we'll do eight. And then put them in this little sandwich bag after, so they don't go stale. Maybe I'll do a small one, because we don't need them like that. Not so big. Taylor Swift, uh, is Taylor Swift not going to New Zealand? Look, I, I had some strong thoughts about Taylor Swift. Um, which we're not going to get into. Because, yeah. I like her, I think she's a great songwriter. But I do think that there is some shakiness from in the background that people don't really see. I feel there's a bit of shade in um, So I love her artistic vibes and all that stuff. I think she's a great songwriter. Love her songs. Like I'll sing to them in the car, but I just feel, I just feel there's a little bit of, you know, yeah. Anyway, we're not gonna go into that. We're all about love and positivity. Two minutes. Oh, good luck with that editing. So I'm looking. I'm looking at the iPad here because the comments they only last for like five seconds or ten seconds until some of them just comments and then fades away on my phone. So I, if I miss something, I don't want to miss it. So I'm just reading on the iPad. I've got myself on me. Um, getting tickets oh my god my a lot of my friends try to get tickets crazy crazy and also um Coldplay here in Perth as well they were on like the online ticket thing for ages with Coldplay and I was like oh good luck trying to get that it's not gonna happen okay let me just quickly just turn this right pan on again Nicole's, um, what's that Anastasia Beverly Hills video did very well. I think it's on like 1250 1, views now, almost 1300. So that did very well for her. She's famous now. Um, so that's exciting. And your other videos, Nicole did it to over like 100 plus views on them. So that's good. What's that like? Um, just putting my diced onions in the frying pan and just getting them nice and softened up before I put the um, broccoli in. Sorry, I keep turning back, but I like to clean as I go because I hate cleaning up after. So if I can clean most of it all up after, then it's great. Especially when the fish takes a good. 40 minutes to actually cook and all that. And you can probably not hear me at all. You probably couldn't hear anything I just said then, so I apologize. Let me just put 
turn my back to you guys again. Just clean up the tongue that I use for raw chicken. We don't like cross contamination here in this house. No, ma'am. That can be clean and I will add a little wooden spoon. Ooh, yummy. That's good. Okay, what did I miss? Uh, uh, Nicole, ah, uh, sorry. Yeah, it takes a thousand subscribers. Okay, that steam is directly in front of my camera, so we'll move that. A thousand subscribers and 4,000 watched hours in a 12 month period. So I've got a thousand subscribers, but I've only got 300 watched hours because I'm lazy as um, with my editing and uploading and stuff. So yeah, it, it takes a while to get up there. But one day we'll get there. Lottie should, um, well, Lottie does a lot more than I do on YouTube and stuff than TikTok and everything, you know. So, she should definitely get monetized before me. I think her watched hours will be up there, but mine are not that good. Yeah, I just, I now yeah, just do it for fun. Like, I don't think I'll ever get monetized, which I'm, I'm fine with, you know. Hell, if people occasionally send me a free item or two, then that's even great because I can save my bank account. Since we're not getting any money for our videos or our time, people don't realize that I think an average video, like a full makeup tutorial, could take, I would say, at least six or seven full hours of work. And if you're getting paid, you know, like $20 an hour minimum or whatever, you know, that's $140 that you've spent creating that video and if you're not getting any money out of that and you're doing that three or four times a week then you know you, you're not getting you get the views and all that and that's great but you're not getting any money that's not including the makeup that you actually spent to make that video um it's it can be quite depressing sometimes where's my oh. it can be very depressing actually I'm just throwing my um, broccoli in now with the onion, because the onion is softened. Uh, and we're just going to completely cook the broccoli and onion together. I'm using the same pan, so it's still got all the marinade, like onion, garlic, chili in there. And we're just going to kind of steam that a little bit with the lid on. Yeah, see, 2,000 hours, I'm, I'm only at 300, I think 310 hours, which is just nowhere near what needs to be. So I don't see myself getting monetized anytime soon. One day, maybe. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. It's very hard to grow on YouTube. A lot harder than what I expected. Pay to boost, I'm not really, I mean, I guess pay views and stuff. I know like Instagram, I get emails constantly like, oh, we're social media marketing. If you want, you know, 4,000 interactions on your post, then we just, we do that for you and we, you just have to pay us a certain amount a month. I don't do any of that because first, first of all, I can't afford to do any of that stuff, but I just, I don't really care to do that. You know, that's not really for me. Um, and my, my Instagram is just, it's not there because I don't post enough. I don't do enough on there. Like, you know, I'll occasionally post something on there when I do a video or makeup look, but that might be once or twice a week. So, you know, that's on me. That's not, that's just me being lazy. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> I see. I don't really mind at not being monetized. Like it'd be nice. Um, on my shorts, I think I've got twelve thousand views on my shorts. So I'm a long way away from ten million. <laughs> so I am not relying on that either. But you know, it's it's nice. All right. So that's done. I just yeah. It's fun. I like new makeup. I'm excited about the Glam Light Halloween collection. Even Nomads, like I'll be interested to see their Halloween because they've teased it, but they haven't shown anything else besides something new is coming. Um, the Hershey's collection, I want the two palettes and the white highlighter, cookies and cream highlighter. And I want um, the Kaleidos liners, like the multi-chrome liners. I want those because I've had my heart set on those. But, you know, it's all about funds. I also am um, planning on, I mean, I'm going to Fiji, so I want to, you know, have some spending money on that and make sure that I've got everything, um, you know, SD card-wise and all that for my GoPro. So I've got to make sure that everything is good there and pay for my cat to be boarded while I'm away for the two weeks, which will be about, I think it'll be close to about $400, which is not a lot of money, but it's just things I have to do. And I have to take him to the vets and get him vaccinated. Again, every year you have to do it, but it has to be close to when you're getting him um, boarded at the cat. So I have to get that done a month before because they, they need proof that you've done it. Um, remember, Nicole, to use like the hashtag, short hashtags and all that type of stuff. That does help, I find, with my videos, if you use the right hashtags. Hashtag video, hashtag shorts, um, hashtag short. That helps a lot. Oh, that's looking good. That is looking good. Okay. Going to just quickly transfer it back into this bowl with the onion. And then we're going to cook the um, mushrooms. And I'll throw in the peas and stuff. And then everything will be done. I'll just mix it all together. And voila, we have some food. Um, I'm excited about, I know Bonnie got me the new pink highlighter trio, she got that for me, so I'll get that um, later on, So, um, but I'm excited that she got me that because obviously the Oprah can't, or doesn't ship to Australia, so I got her to purchase me that. And I think she's going to get me some new lashes, some more lashes that she got me last time in the mystery box from the um, Uni, I think that's the range, from Dollar Tree and stuff, so excited to get that. So that will be coming whenever it comes from the US, whenever they decide to send things to me. That's right, Courtney did a good job. I want to actually get that setting powder from Courtney and the eyeshadow palette. I've decided I want the eyeshadow palette as well because I was watching um, her TikTok or Instagram reel where she just did that like greeny bluey shade that you like to use as well, I think, Lottie. Um, and I was like, I need to have that in my collection. So I'm going to get that palette as well um, eventually. These are all things I want to get. Just throwing some mushrooms in now with some hot oil and then just stir that around and that will take a couple minutes to cook. I love mushrooms. They are my favourite food. See you, Nicole. Thank you for joining. Right? Yeah, for me it was, um, it was something to do. You know, something that was mine that, um, I could do in my own house and all that type of stuff. So that's why I did the YouTube and I've just created, I've had or made so many friends, great friends and stuff like that. Learned a lot. I'm still learning every day from makeup. Um, so I think it's just fun. For me, it's fun. Like I like the process of it all. Um, and I'm excited to keep doing it. But I feel like I need to do, do maybe more lives and stuff where I can just get videos up. For you guys so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do cooking and just talking to you guys and all that type of stuff makeup tutorials where i don't have to edit i just need to find the time to do it um 
also a client that got new neighbours and they do a lot of, I think they're kind of renovating their house, so it's, it's hard to find a time where I'm awake and they're not making noise next door where you'll be able to still hear me in the video. So um, that's a little bit hard lately. I've, I think yesterday I sat down to do filming and then they started drilling or banging in the, in the um, bathroom right next to me or behind me and I couldn't hear anything so I just stopped filming. So that's always fun. Colourpop doesn't excite me. There's nothing really Colourpop wise that excites me right now. Their new blush collections, I don't use cream blushes or bronzers, so I'm not going to get any of that stuff. I like their cream gel liners, I like their um, Super Shocks. Some of the eyeshadow palettes, like, I still use them, but they're not, they haven't been like, I need to get this eyeshadow palette. I think the last one I got was uh, a whole collection, um, and I really like that collection, but it was one that I, you know, before that I hadn't bought anything from Colourpop for almost a year. Um, so it's just something I, I don't know. Colourpop has to have something really, really good that I want, that I haven't seen from them, or that I don't have in my collection, because I can't be bothered waiting for the shipping prices or the shipping time, and also for items to come broken. It's just, it's not interesting to me anymore. Yeah, Lonnie, that would be great. I'd love to do that. Like if we do a weekly live, you know, sometime when Morgan's gone to work and you know, I'm not working or something like that, that would be great because we could do that and have a makeup tutorial. And just talk about new releases. Maybe we could do like a, every fortnight or every week, we could um, get a list of like the new makeup releases and we could do like a purchase of pass, get ready with me. And we both talk about our opinions of the new makeup and stuff like that. That could be something we could do, um, Lottie. We could save, in, you know, new makeup releases, talk about things that we're trying right now that we love, especially like since I'm doing speed reviews and you do speed reviews, we could do like a, oh, have you tried this? This is what I'm loving. And then we'll do the update version in our speed reviews. Yeah, we haven't done a live in forever. I, I just haven't done one in such a long time. All right, mushrooms are getting sucked. We're gonna put the peas in, cook them out, and then we'll just put everything together and it will be done. And I can sit down and eat, because I'm hungry. Sorry, I'm just gonna quickly wash this guy for one second. So it's all done. Yeah, right. Got Renault's and stuff. Yeah. But it'll be good to do more lives and stuff, you know, and catch up. I still gotta get that Blend Bunny palette off you. I should have just um, paid for shipping. <laughs> Got you to ship it to me at this stage, because it's been like four or five months, I think, since, the last, since that one's come out. Um, and then they've had, I think, two other releases since then. Lip oils and blush palettes and the other palettes, but yeah. your house new I think I think it's been renovated I don't think it's brand new it's like they moved into it already built but I think it got most of it was renovated the kitchen is so lovely I love her kitchen nothing compared to my small kitchen here so good all right guys so that is basically done I'm gonna throw everything in together now chicken we have the broccoli and onions all together. Oh, this is going to be so good. 
Mm. Now it's such a pretty house, so nice and nice and big as well, which is great. And you have your own little makeup room, which is also good. I'm excited to see it completely done. And then you, um, whatever you're going to do to it, will be good. It will be very, very good. And then I think it also that room is a good size because you can do like your plus size holes in it. You have a bit more room to like move around and stuff in your videos when you do those videos, which is good. Um, yeah, that's exciting. Okay, I'm just stirring everything up. Everything's basically done. I'm just going to put some of this ketchup menace, which is um, a sweet soy sauce. It's thick, so it's um, great for marinating. So I just put a whole lot of that on top. And then I mix it in. And let that kind of caramelize all the noodles and everything together. Yum. Put the lid on and just leave that on simmer for a little bit. I am um, only thing I want to do stuff to my house. I just got a new fridge, which I'm excited about because my other the freezer was working, but the fridge stopped working, and then it'll turn on and then stop and stuff. So you just couldn't rely on it. And like I'd come home from work, okay. I'd come home from work and the fridge would be not on, so I'd like lose all the meat or whatever that was in it. So I'd have to throw that out. So I'd just stop using the fridge um, and just use the freezer and then it started making a noise, the freezer did, so I just stopped using it all together. Um, I need a bit more sauce on that. Just a little bit more. Not too much. That's a lot of food. Um, but yeah, I'm happy that my fridge is working. I want to eventually get some Maybe any cash, not that I need it right now. A new TV I do need, I dropped my other small one on my um, filming table and it broke, so you need one of those. Yum. <clears throat> Been reading the Bible, Lottie. Uh, yeah, that's very spicy. Lots of drama in that. I'm joking, of course. Let me just bring this over to you guys. So you can kind of hear what I'm doing. Even though I'm going to be washing up, you'll still be able to kind of hear what I'm doing. Oh, that lighting is terrible. Maybe I'll turn that light off. Oh. So Lottie, what's your next video? What do you have planned? I know you're obviously working on your vlog. Ooh, that's very close, sorry. Um, yeah. Mm. Mm. 
yeah, that other lady was better. Um, yeah, my TV, I've got my sister's old TV, um, which doesn't, it's okay, it doesn't really, like I just play Xbox on it. But the other TV I had was where I filmed on my desk and I used to just play Xbox on that um, because it was right, right there and could sit up a bit easier. Um, but I actually tipped it and it just went backwards and smashed the screen. So that doesn't work anymore. It was th two and a half, three years old. And I think when I bought it, I bought it from online from Kogan, which was, you know, an online store. And that was three and a half years ago. And it was probably 400 when I bought it. So it wasn't expensive at all. Um, so I'd just probably do the same thing. Or appliance online is also really good. Okay. Oh. Why am I stirring with these stupid things? Let me just quickly try this, guys. I think it's done. I'm just going to try a little piece. It's always good to try before you take it off the heat. Um, if I need to add any, like, what do you call it? Salt, I can. Just mainly try the chicken and the noodles because everything else I know will be good. I don't eat on camera, so I apologize. Mmm. My bowl. Oh, that's hot. Temperature wise, not chili wise. But seasoning is perfect. That is really good. Nice, yep. That's good. Alright, before I forget, I need to squeeze some lemon juice over this. Just a cheek of lemon juice or lemon. Just to cut through a little bit of that oil and freshen it up. And then I do add some sesame seeds into the plate that I get. I don't add it on now. I don't every time I have some because I microwave it and sometimes sesame seeds in the microwave don't really hold up. I don't know why, they just don't. So I microwave it and then put sesame seeds on top after. But yeah, this is the dish, guys. Oh, that's good. Okay. I'm going to have some food now, guys. I'm going to quickly serve some up and I'll show you what it looks like. I don't want to bring the whole entire thing over. Marinade on the bottom is the best. Alright. This is what it looks like, guys. Oh, that steam. That's what it looks like. So yummy. I'm gonna put a little bit of sesame seeds on top. Oh, nice. That's good, I always like your plus size ones, Lottie. They always do well, like some of your um, shorts did very well on this as well, which is always good for the channel. And also get some other brands to see you. All right, that's what it looks like with the sesame seeds on it. That is my favorite dish that I like to make. Eat. Well, it's not quick, but it's easy. So, yeah, guys, let me just get rid of this apron. This video was all over the place. I 100% know it's all over the place, but it's just something I wanted to do. My idea of me talking to you about new makeup releases didn't work because you couldn't hear me when I was trying the chicken on the stove and all that type of stuff, and I was getting distracted. So, I think I will just do a new makeup release later on. Maybe Lottie when we do a live sometime I'll do it then. But for now I'm just gonna I'm hungry. <laughs> Bring you some. One day Lottie. Maybe I'll cook it we can cook maybe we can do a cooking video together Lottie. That would be fun I think. And so just a makeup one we can do a cooking video. Hmm yeah, they would. <laughs> oh, 
All right, guys, with that, guys, I'm going to go. I'm going to eat this. I'm hungry. I'm going to, it's three, five past three already. I'm going to um, put my washing on in the dryer. I couldn't do that while I was filming because of the noise in the background, but I'm going to do that. I'm going to feed my cat. I don't know what the weather's like where you are, Lottie, but it is really windy outside here and it's very grey. It's been raining on and off. It's been really bad. The wind is howling. Um, so I just want to kind of stay indoors and keep warm. So I'm going to do that and then I'm going to um, maybe film a makeup tutorial using my Too Faced Italian Spritz palette, which I need to get around to. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Nicole, and thank you, um, buddy. Hit the like button if you like it, guys, and I will see you next time. Bye!